We are in Office 365 Exchange Online. I'm gonna show you how to see who has access to the remote PowerShell. So you may not want all your users to have access to remote PowerShell, and by default, they're going to have it. Now they're gonna have limited abilities, but still, you may or may not want them to have access into it. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna type in get dash mailbox, just to see a list of users. All right, so there's all of our users in our organization. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna say get dash user, and let's just pick a user, we'll pick uh, Mike T. And we're going to see if Mike has access into Remote PowerShell. And I'm in Remote PowerShell right now, so that's how you know <laughs> that I have access. So after uh, get user Mike T, we're going to choose uh, the pipe command, then format dash list, remote PowerShell enabled. Now this does not enable it or disable it, it just gives us a list. And there it is, Mike T does have access into remote PowerShell. Now I've done another video where it shows you how to disable it or enable it based on whatever it is that you like. So take a look at the playlist and you can find that video.